Hey, welcome back to another episode of Live It Out. I'm John Merwin, one of the pastors here at Crosswater. And this week we looked at the parable of the rich fool in Luke chapter 12. And in verse 15, Jesus says that a man's life does not consist in the abundance of his possessions. It means life's not about our stuff. We, we don't have life through our wealth and through our possessions. But yeah, that's kind of contradictory to what our society would say. We love to accumulate stuff, including me. I've got more Blu-rays than, than almost anybody I know, which is just ridiculous. But life does not consist in the abundance of our possessions. True life is found in Jesus. Yet this time of year particularly, we are just bombarded with all these messages, these advertisements about all the stuff that we need. Stuff that will make our life better. One ad that just kind of cracks me up right now just talks about the extravagance of Christmas and how people just get crazy with, with all of the stuff that they do. And then they encourage you to, to go to this reasonable event. It's the, the age of reason, I think they call it, event. You know what the event's for? It's to buy an Acura. And the last time I checked, an Acura is a pretty expensive vehicle. How that's reasonable, I don't know. But that's just an example of some of the advertising that we're seeing right now this time of year. We see it all year, but really at Christmas time, it's when it kicks in, making us feel like what we have isn't good enough, that we need more, we need better, we need different. Well, Jesus says, that's foolish. The parable we looked at, this man built up, or had all this all these crops, and he had to build new barns to fit it all. And he was selfish with his wealth. He tried to store it all up so he could kick back and take life easy, and then he died before he could use any of it. True life is found only in Jesus. Jesus is the only thing that will last. All of our stuff, even if we pass it on to our kids and their grandkids, eventually it doesn't last. It's gone. It gets, it gets wasted. It gets squandered. Either it leaves us while we're here or we leave it when we die. It doesn't last. Only Jesus lasts. So if you're living for anything other than Jesus right now, it's not going to last. So the, the live it out, the application this week, is take a look at your life. Is your stuff and your possessions what's important to you? Or is Jesus what's important to you? Who are you living for? What are you living for? If it's not for Jesus, it's for something else. And it's not going to last. So take a look at your life. See, is Jesus enough for me? Is Jesus my reward? He should be, and he can be. He is. He is enough. We just have to let him be. So have a good week this week, and we'll see you next week.